Jack Sock. How did you celebrate on Saturday night after you won? Uh, just friends and family. We uh, we were staying in a house there, um, so it was nice. We all got to go back and we just relaxed and uh, playing some music and just hanging out. And uh, we've been playing Monopoly all week, so we played a celebratory game of Monopoly and and uh, kind of just enjoyed company with each other. And how was the Wimbledon ball? That was uh, that was very special. Um, you got to take a guest, and, and my dad had flown in just for the final, so. Uh, I don't get to see him a whole lot. Obviously, I'm traveling and, and he's working, so uh, that was very special for me to be able to take uh, take him and, and kind of enjoy that whole experience. So when you got here, you presented the Hall of Fame with the shoes that you wore at Wimbledon. Did you expect to be in the Hall of Fame already at this young age? I did not. No. Uh, when when uh, when Sharko came up and, and asked uh, if I had something I could I could donate, I, I was. Uh, a little bit taken back, but uh, yeah, obviously I was uh, I was all for uh, giving something and, and being able to uh, be a part of that pretty historic and and, uh, and special uh, place in the Hall of Fame. So by winning Wimbledon, you and Vashik now have a chance to qualify for the Barclays ATP World Tour Finals. What would it mean to you to actually be among the top eight? Yeah, that um, kind of after everything, we, after we kind of settled down, some people brought that up to us and. Um, we hadn't really realized it yet, and, and, and uh, now that's kind of one of our main focuses now, because uh, to be able to do it now, and, and um, I mean, I think even in doubles, even, even if it's in doubles, it's, uh, I've heard it's an unbelievable event and uh, an absolutely amazing, um, the amazing job they do there and, and uh, kind of a special event to play in. So I think if we are able to uh, partake in that at the end of the year, that's, that, that'll be very, uh, very special for us.